definite article can also be used before proper nouns when we represent a person as a quality look at this sentence Sachin Tendulkar is the batsman. What do you mean when I say Sachin Tendulkar is the batsman? Here I mean Sachin Tendulkar is the perfect batsman or is better than any other batsman. Okay? So here I am using Sachin Tendulkar as an epitome. What I would call an epitome which is a person representing a quality. Okay? So in this case also we can use the definite article fine finally we also use the definite article before centuries dates etc okay india in which century in the 20th century okay so before the names of centuries also we add the the 19th century the 17th century etc and similarly for dates also the 24th of march or the 1st of august okay so there also we use the definite article all right friends till now we were dealing with where we should use articles okay but we should also remember certain areas where we should willingly omit articles okay so unnecessary usage of articles also should be avoided let's see where we should omit articles We find that we don't use the definite article before the names of meals. We don't say, I had the breakfast at 8 a.m. this morning. No. Or I don't say, will you come to my house for the lunch? No. But then there is, there is again an exception to this rule. You can say the breakfast or the lunch or the dinner when you are being specific. For example, you can say, the breakfast which we had at the Rajdhani Hotel was not good. Okay, there we are being specific about a particular breakfast. In that case, the usage of the definite article is allowed. But otherwise, when you are use, when you are talking about breakfast, dinner, or lunch in a general sense, you don't use any article. Similarly, we don't use the definite article before the names of people. Okay, that's quite clear. We don't say the John or the Ram or the Abdul no we also don't use the definite article before names of languages we don't say the English or the French fine we don't use any article before the names of languages friends you should also remember that the definite article is not used before modes of travel you don't say He traveled by there. No. You say he traveled by air, he traveled by road, or he traveled by train. Similarly, you don't use the definite article before names of substances like gold or silver. You don't say this spoon is made of the gold. No. But again, the exception is you can use the definite article when you are referring to gold of a particular place or gold of a particular origin. For example, you can say the gold mined in that mine is not of good quality. There you know you are referring to a particular gold. Okay, Not any gold found in the world, but particularly the gold mined from that area. So there you can say the gold. Similar is the case with virtues like honesty 
sincerity faithfulness etc okay we say honesty is the best policy but we say the honesty of a judge should not be questioned okay in the second case we are being specific okay there it is the honesty of a particular person fine and finally places like college or church when we are speaking about them in their general usage i mean why do people go to college obviously to study and you go to a church to worship so if that if that is a usage you are intending in that case these words do not take an article for example in both these examples it's quite clear why the student goes to college and why she goes to church okay so why should a student go to college obviously to study and she goes to church every sunday to worship but take another set of examples friends was held at the college and a terrorist attack destroyed the church so what happened here why did we add the definite article here because in these sentences college and church are used in the sense of buildings okay here i speak about college and church as buildings so in that case we should use the definite article so the rule is when we are speaking about church or college with reference to its purpose then there is no article but if you are referring to them as buildings then we use the all right